name is Angela LaRocca and we are here at the MVF Monthly Breakfast inside the Moda Museum. I am standing next to our wonderful keynote speaker this morning, Jerry Steiner of Arvagenics. How are you, Jerry? I'm doing great. Had a very fun morning. You did. You revved up everyone here, pun intended, because we are around motorcycles. <laughs> um, talk a little bit about Arvagenics. Well, Arvagenics is a company that is developing a new crop, Pennycrest. Mm. Currently, we're domesticating because it, it's a weed uh, that can be a crop that fits between corn and soybeans and brings both sustainability and profitability. Wow, that is quite the concept you've got there. Something that really stu stood out in your presentation, you said from yield to field. Can you elaborate a little bit on that? Well, what I was talking about is that, you know, for this concept to work, and we are a startup company, we're really in our development kind of phase. Mm -hmm. One of our biggest challenges is taking this plant and unleashing its natural yield potential. And we're using breeding and genomics and agronomics to really bring that yield in the field up. Because that's what the farmer is going to look at ultimately, is this sure. has to make sense in the field. Right, right. And you did say a key to your success is it's all about the team. Talk a little bit about the people that you have surrounded yourself with at the company. Well, I'm really lucky uh, to be surrounded by uh, people that have had phenomenal careers, are mm -hmm. wonderful in that they're, they're brilliant, but you know, I've seen lots of brilliant people in my career. What these people are uh, uniquely good at, in my opinion, is being smart and that when two people work together, we're, we're two and a half, not one and a half. Uh, so teamwork uh, is really comes out of it. So Dennis Plummer, uh, the chief business officer, has been with it from the beginning. Uh, Mark Mesmer and Mark Lawson in breeding. Uh, Jerry Yelly in regulatory. And Chris Handel, uh, who is really our day-to-day -day scientist and pulls it all together. I, uh, and we've got some other, other folks, too. Um, but we're really lucky to have those folks here in St. Louis in our, in our office and um, pushing us forward. Wow. Well, you are certainly doing great things. You are shaking up the industry. Um, I would think quite a compliment to you as a speaker is people kept asking questions this morning. My goodness. How do you feel when the things that you say are just getting people so energized and inspired? Well, it is exciting to be around uh, an idea that um, people can find the part that's really interesting to them. You know, some audiences really uh, see the fact that this corn soybean rotation is incredibly economically important. It's right. the foundation of much of the food system. Uh, it, it doesn't necessarily show up on your plate, but it makes so many other things. But they're concerned about its long-term viability and sustainability. So to see a new idea that doesn't ask farmers to make a trade-off hmm. on economically producing uh, corn and soybeans, but can bring sustainability, you know, that's an interesting idea to virtually every segment. Farmers, uh, people who uh, you know care about many other things. Wow, wow, that gets me really excited just about what's going on, what's on the horizon in St. Louis when there are people like you that are coming in and doing great things. So Jerry, I have to ask, um, who inspires you? Who motivates you to just get up every day? And like you said, which I love this, when you leave work more energized than when you got there, it's a good day. Who does that for you? <laughs> That's a great and tough question. I, you know, <laughs> I, I think um, you have to be, you, you get energy from the people that you work with and around. Mm -hmm. um, you get energy from turning a, a vision into a reality. So I think my, my, my teammates at work uh, do that for me uh, whenever I get out and that's about what I'm about to go do is go out into the countryside and you know talk to farmers who are really interested wow. in this idea that, that brings a lot of energy absolutely well you're doing such a great job you're doing tremendous things in st. Louis I know there's going to be great success for Arvagenics where can one find more information about the company well at the easiest place would be just go to our website okay. www.arvagenics.com Got it. Thank you so much, Jerry. We were very lucky to have you. The audience cannot say enough good things about you. Your ears will be burning all day. <laughs> Thank <laughs> Thanks, you. Jerry. To learn more about MVF, visit mvfstl.org. MVF, where entrepreneurs go to grow.